Hello everybody. This is Elena, the artist here. Playing Pokemon Black version. I haven't played this game in so long. I borrowed this from somebody. <laughs> but um let's just play. And I'm gonna start with new game. Cause I'm lazy like that. Hello, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Juniper. Everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Technically that's Professor Oaks. My recording, I hate this. That's right, this world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures. But Pokemon! Pokemon have mysterious power. They come in many shapes and live in many different places. We humans live happily with Pokemon, living and working together. We complete each other or complement each other. We help each other out to accomplish different tasks. Happy Pokemon battles with one another is practically the most popular and it deepens the bond between people and Pokemon. And that is why I research Pokemon. Well, enough about me. Could you tell me a bit about yourself? Are you a boy or are you a girl? I'm a boy, I'm a girl. You're a girl, right? Yes. I'd like to know your name. Please tell me. My name is... Actually, I should just use my real name. Duh, but I don't wanna... Trust me, I'll do this in any other games too. I normally won't use my real name. But for the heck of it, I'm just gonna use my real name. Your name is Lena. Yes. So, your name is Lena. What a wonderful name. Well then, I'm going to introduce you to your best friends. Two best friends. Yay! This young man is Churin. He can be a little difficult, but a very honest person. <laughs> a very honest person. This young woman is Bianca. She's a little flighty, but she has a very hard work. She works very hard. I think you three have the potential, so... I'm going to give it to you. A very, very important Pokemon. I'm gonna give you a very important Pokemon. I should just click. Why am I not clicking fast enough? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Elena. The moment you choose the Pokemon that will accompany you on your journey, your story will truly begin. During your journey, you will meet many Pokemon, many people with different personalities and point of views. I really hope you'll find it is important to you in all your travels. That's right! Befriending new people and Pokemon. You grow as a person. That is the most important goal of your journey. Let's go visit the Pokemon world. Winter. It's summer! What? You know what? I normally hated this. But since it's winter... That means I could just walk over icy terrain in certain towns. And actually, I like the weather system in this game. Although I hated that everyone else didn't like this game, though, and said it was an original. Sharon! Elena! 
I heard from Professor Juniper we have Pokemon. What's keeping Bianca? Sorry! I'm a little late again. I'm so, so sorry! Bianca. I know. Oh, for t I know you for 10 years. You have no sense of time. Seriously. Today is the day we can get a Pokemon from Professor Juniper. And you're late. I know. I'm sorry, Elena. I'm sorry, Turan. So, where are the Pokemon? They were delivered to New York house, Elena, right? So, Elena should get the first pick. Naturally. The Pokemon are waiting for us inside that gift box. Okay, Elena. You go first and take a peek at the box. Sorry. <laughs> I want to meet the Pokemon right now. Okay, okay. Jeez. The first saving. Saving is the most important thing you guys should do. Would you play a game? You guys hear that? It's thunder. Outside my house. And it's raining. Yay! Okay. All I know, open the gift box. Y'all can read. I'm not gonna read this for you. Now let's see, what Pokemon do we have here? We have... A Tempic, Snivy, and an Oshawa. What should I choose? I'm gonna pick an Oshawa. Why? Because everyone doesn't like it, and I'm the only person that likes it. Well, the only person that I know of that likes it. Everyone else just craps on it. In this generation. <laughs> and any other generation. Uh, like, Gen 6, 7, possibly 8. But I like Samurai for many reasons. Competitively, basically, but daggers can't be choosers, and I'm picking this anyway. Don't hate me. <laughs> oh, you chose Oshawa. Yaka. Okay, I'll take this Pokemon. Chiran, that one is yours. Hey, how come you get to pick out of my? My Pokemon. Never mind. I want to sign you from the start anyway. Everyone has their Pokemon? So that's that. So that's that. <laughs> hey, I know. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Honestly, Bianca, even though oh, we're still weak Pokemon. You shouldn't have Pokemon battles inside a house. Don't be a worry, War. These little guys aren't weak. Like you said. These little guys are weak, like you said. We have to let them battle so they can get stronger. It's settled, Elena. Get ready for a Pokemon battle. Wait, I agree with Trend. Don't battle in my house! Especially in my room. I know it's gonna get destroyed later. Yeah, good chose Tempest. So that means I have the advantage. If only it was shiny. Even though the shiny, you can't tell the difference. The only one shiny in the starters of this generation is actually better, and I appreciate more. 
is Tampig's evolutionary line, but in my mind, Emport doesn't deserve that shiny coloring. Oh god. I should have started off a tackle in the beginning. Oh, thank god he used Tail Whip! I'm gonna win this! Bye, Tempig! Sorry, Bianca, but I want to win. And my room is destroyed. Wow. Elena, you're gonna be an awesome trainer someday. I can tell. No doubt. Uh. Bianca, would you take a look around? <laughs> Whoa, what happened? Wow, Pokemon are amazing. So little, but so strong! I'm so glad we have my Pokemon. Oh, um, sorry about your room, Elena. My room. It's fine. You are completely hopeless. Here, I'll restore your Pokemon. Elena's Pokemon needs fixing up too. Hey, Tren. How about you battle, too? With all you know, I'm sure you could end a battle without turning a room into a disaster like I did. I believe you're right. It would be no problem for me to keep the room from getting eaten in the mess. <laughs> what the heck was that? Unfortunately for me, I'm not doing this. Actually, I'm glad I'm not doing this live, but that's terrible. <laughs> Besides, it's not fair if you two who are the only ones who get to battle for fun. Oh, it's not even the lines, but I already know where they're going with this, so. Yeah. It's decided you'll be my opponent in our first Pokemon battle. Let's see what you could do, Snivy. And Melina vs. Tren! <laughs> if you can't tell by my voice, I am very tired. Tren seems anxiety. Wanna know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna spend Tail Whip! Twice! Don't die, Oshawa! I will cry if you do! Don't let me down as my favorite Pokemon in Gen 5! <gasps> oh! Oh! Ho, ho, ho. No! No! I give up. At least he wins. Don't worry, I will be here for my revenge. REVENGE! What stats are you even anyway? I'm not reset- CALM! What? I'm not resetting. I'm keeping this. I'm going with this. Nope. This is fine. 
I can work with this. I'm fine. And normally I wouldn't care about the natures, but to lose to your rival is not okay. Oh. Did was I supposed to do speaking up? Screw it. Well, um, we can clean it up. Cleaning up? No worries. I can take care of it later. Shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper? Yes, thank you. Please excuse us. Come on. Um, let's go thank Professor Juniper. I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab. Uh, oh, wait. I... Gotta go home first! Thanks for having us over! And they leave. My, my, Elena! Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? I can hear your Pokemon's cry from down here. Sure reminds me of my first Pokemon battle. Oh, and you know what? After a Pokemon battle, your Pokemon need rest. Thanks, Mom. Your Pokemon is looking great. Now, if you get run out, don't forget your cross receiver. Or the X transceiver. Or Cross communication device. You're going to thank the professor too, right? Better get going, honey. Bye, mom. And sad part is, get your running shoes way late. Wait, what? But it's not even. It's not even daytime. Why is the moon shining like that? This is your aunt's house. And this is Bianca's house. No, no, a thousand times, no! But I'm... I'm a good trainer who got a Pokemon and everything. We could totally go on an adventure. <gasps> oh... It's okay. I I'll be waiting for you in front of the lab, okay? Yeah. Uh. Mm -hmm. Why do you have to be such a wet blanket? What nonsense is this? How could my daughter, who knows nothing about the world, be going on a journey of no on her own with a Pokemon? <laughs> Hmm. Don't mind my husband here. He can be a bit overprotective. All children go on an adventure with Pokemon. It's just a part of growing up. Yeah, well, why can't he understand that? I want to check if she's okay. Okay, let's go meet the professor. Hi there! I've been waiting for very young people. Let me introduce myself well, again. My name is Professor Juniper. We know your name. Come, Jared. It's not all the time to take things lightly. Today's the day to remember always, so oh, it's best to behave with formality. That being so, once again, my name is Professor Jr. 
and I'm researching Pokemon. Then Oh, that's unusual. You already had a Pokemon battle. So maybe that's why... It feels as though your Pokemon have already begun to trust you. By the way, would you like to give your Pokemon a nickname? Yes. And I'm going to name him... Sam. Uh -huh. I see. Are you okay with nicknaming your Pokemon Sam? Yes. Sam it is then. That's such a great name. As for why I have evolved. As for why I gave you all Pokemon. It's for the Pokedex, right? Pokedex? I am astonished. Nice work, Jiren. You have already studied Pokemon extensively, haven't you? Still, let me explain everything from the beginning for everyone's sake. The Pokedex is a high-tech device that had a uh, automatically records the Pokemon a new encounter. So, uh, I want you to... You three to visit in many places and, and meet Popa in Unova. And since there's no national dex, again, people, this isn't the first time we never had a national dex, and I'm still upset at the people who keep complaining. Where's my national dex? I want the national dex. Pokemon, sorry to feel this guy's side. Well, suck it up, you babies. Sorry, I'm being mean. <clears throat> Anyways, this is my request. Elena, Tren, Bianca, you will go on an adventure to complete the Pokedex, will you not? Sure, why not? I have nothing better to do. Okay. I mean, yes, Professor. Thank you very much. Because of you, I could become a Pokemon trainer. Exactly as I always wished. All of you, thanks! You have given me the best possible answer. I wonder what happens if I just said no. She'll just give me the decks anyway. Probably. Next, I need to teach you how to meet Pokemon. Please meet me at Route 1, okay? I probably might have to speed up for people who know how to play Pokemon anyway. But, um, for the people who don't, and it's 2019, y'all should know how to catch Pokemon. I already know how to catch Pokemon, so it's really no brainer, but sometimes I will. Throw a Pokeball when they're at full HP, and for some reason, Goes in anyway. That's weird, right? You know, that's weird. Normally, you're supposed to get them at red and catch them with a, a Pokeball. Or you're at the Pokemon Safari, nonetheless, and you have to feed them and whatever. But surprisingly, in this game, there is no Pokemon Safari that I have seen. There's a Pokemon like friend, place, or pal, whatever, but there is no there's no national park or whatever for you to catch Pokemon freely, so that's the downside. But there is the battle train, which We'll get to later. Since the professor asked us, is it okay to go on an adventure, right? I can explore and find out many things? 
course. We can travel with however we want. While we complete the Pokedex. And I mean nerds bye. Huh? Come on! I'm gonna wait up. Rude, push me in the way. Oh, hi there. Her mom? Hey there. There you are, and... What did profess- what did the professor have to say? She asked us to complete the Pogodex. She asked you to complete the Pokedex? I just said that. I can't believe it! Well, actually, I can. I already you knew she was gonna ask. If you knew she was gonna ask, why'd you ask me? Ma'am! That's why I brought the three of you to the Beast Town Mass. Take a look at you! Thanks, Mom. Not gonna really need it because I know where I'm going. Here you are, Trent. I'll take good care of it. And one for you too, Bianca. so much. As for your room, Elena, or what's left of it. Wait, what? No need for you to worry. I'll take care of it. Okay, Elena. Ah, Pokemon, they're so cute, but also very tough. Some of them destroy whole bedrooms. There are something. The Pokemon like think that at your side. You'll be safe, Hella. Huh? Where will you go? I'll let your parents know. I hope that, that in addition to you Ooh, Pokemon, you'll find lots and lots of places. You'll make you get me you know, a lot of you. And become what wonderful adults. Have a good trip. She was so willing to let us leave. <laughs> Most parents would be like, "No, it's too dangerous. You're only actually characters in Pokemon Black and White are at least fourteen or fifteen in this game, while everyone else is ten. Wait, no." Pokemon red, blue, green, yellow, they're all ten. Pokemon gold, crystal, and silver, ten. Ruby, sapphire, and emerald, ten. Fourth generation, I think they're ten years old. Probably twelve. No, they're ten. Gen five. Well, I already said that they're 14 or 15 years old. Gen 6, around the same age, 14, 13 maybe. 7th gen, they're 11. 8th gen, I have no idea how old the trainers are going to be. Probably going to be in like the kid bracket. Kid or teen, pre-teen or bracket. I'm gonna stop the game here. I'll see everybody later. Peace.